A new man passing by. Life is good, best I've ever felt. Where can I put you that you can see me? <laughs> Thought I would bring you a little bit into our world. Did you get the um, passwords, Jace? I did. We're good. Jason and I are currently doing money things and while well, that's a lot private <laughs> I just thought I would bring you um, into this little world um, usually it's on Mondays if we you know we just kind of sit here and I sit here and we kind of work through our bills that we need to pay together or separately I'm trying to prop you up here hang on and uh, today I'm adding one little thing that we're gonna do at the bank we have an appointment um, Abby's, not Abby's, Kaylee's CD is renewable and we need to not renew it because she needs to use that money for college. Although, I think, well, I don't know what to do. How much does she need? Who what? Kaylee. Because remember, she has money in her account. Hmm. Could do it for another 30 days. We could float her. Because she does have a decent amount in her account. So we need to either renew her CD or not. Abby's is a seven month CD because she doesn't need the money now. So we're going to the bank, and so I told Chelsea, I looked at my accounts today, and I have a bunch of extra savings accounts on there that I added for Kaylee and Abby back in the day, and now they have actual checking accounts, and they have CD accounts on our on my main account. And so I have some old um, savings accounts on there. Shows that it's for Abby, but I'm gonna go in today, and I'm gonna change the name on one of those to Chelsea, because Chelsea is rolling in some money, and I'm kind of, I always just get a little bit nervous having <laughs> her hang on to this much cash. So I'm going to open up her first official um, savings account when we go. And um, and then we're going to go to Costco. But I just wanted to kind of fill you in just in case I go MIA today. Um, I, yesterday we went on a walk. Um, and normally we don't do that on a Sunday. But Abby wanted to go, and it felt really good to go. We went after church. I took my makeup off, and we went. Um, and it was similar weather to what it is today. It was not cold, but it was not sunny. Northwest gray. Northwest summer. But um, I got home from that, had a good lunch, and late, you know, sat down to watch a show and just relax. And I fell asleep, which felt good. Took a nap. And when I got up from that nap, I felt dizzy and I had major PTSD of vertigo. Um, I've had it twice before. And um, so I laid back down and I was like, not gonna get dizzy, but I wasn't dizzy laying down. I was only dizzy when I made movements, which still made me scared. Um, and it continued through the rest of the night. So I actually stayed on the couch upstairs in my room for about an hour and then down on the downstairs couch for about an hour, hour and a half. And then I moved to my bed um, and stayed there for the rest of the night. Um, it was fine if I wasn't moving, but if I moved, I got dizzy. And it wasn't the same dizzy that I get when I have vertigo. Like, it didn't make me nauseous. It just, I was just, like, I was lightheaded. So I called my dad and talked to him about it. And we've kind of, obviously, like, I can't go to a general practitioner because I can't get into them until October. Um... And I'm having issues with my billing department for my lab work. And so I don't want to like go in and get extra lab work and not understand if, the billing on it. If we have any viewers in other countries, I'd love to know how they go. No, we don't. Because we don't need to be jealous. <laughs> we don't. We do, we do not need to know how other countries actually do healthcare. Um, my dad wanted me to go in and get some blood work. He wants to see if I'm anemic. And I'm betting that I am. Because the last time I... Well, the one time I tried to... No, the last time I tried to donate blood, I was anemic. And that's the first time I've ever been anemic when I went to donate blood. Um, and my blood pressure only goes up when I am in with my doctor trying to get, you know, just a regular checkup. Or when I went to do uh, the plasma donations, my blood pressure was high, so I couldn't do it then. Um, but my blood pressure was fine the last time I tried to donate blood. So I don't think it's my blood pressure. Um, maybe if I go to Target today, I can see if they have like one of those blood pressure machines. There is over by the pharmacy. Yeah. So Just sit down with the old people, get in line with the old people. Thanks, son. <laughs> Thanks, son. I can't show you him because he has every single like credit card bill, open accounts lined up on the, on the desk that he's got open there. Um, 
so I thought I was fine this morning. I, I we, we slept in as much as we could, felt guilty, so we got up, um, had breakfast. I had eggs and like some hash browns and we're out of milk. Otherwise, I would have done a protein, protein yeah, milk. Our kids have lost the ability to cook now that we don't have milk. <laughs> okay, you're going to ignore him just as much as I'm going to ignore him today, just so I apologize in advance for his snarkiness. Um, and for the past hour or so, I'm starting to like get like dizzy spells again. And it's not like all the time, like I'm sitting here and I'm just fine. And if I sit up, I think I'm going to be just fine. But I just walked upstairs to go change my clothes because I have like workout clothes on. I have, I'm just, just going to be kind of casual walking today, but I had like workout shorts on. And I wanted to test how I felt walking up the stairs. And I was like, nope, change out of my workout shorts. I'm not going to go for a walk today. At least I'm not going to go right now. Or I'm not going to go after Costco. I need to just figure out why I'm dizzy. Might go get myself a burger for lunch, get some red meat in me, and then my dad actually told me to get, um, he's funny, oh, can I have my, uh, not that notebook. Oh, uh, you can, I'm done with it. Oh, I know, but my dad, he's like, don't make fun of me, but I take women's um, 40, 40 and older or 50 and older vitamins, is that what he said? I have no idea what we're talking about. My dad, last night on the phone. I wasn't what? there with you. Yes, you were. I was, I went over by the TV and started watching TV. You were standing next to me for the entire conversation. No, I wasn't. No, I, I walked away after a while. You didn't even notice me leaving. Oh. It's fine. It's fine. It's so fine. sad. It's fine if you don't notice so me. So sad that you weren't there for my conversation. Um, but he takes these vitamins for women because he says there's more iron in them and he's um, celiac. So he needs extra iron um, in his diet because he doesn't get it from gluten, I guess. There's a lot of iron in gluten. And maybe that's why I'm not getting it because I'm trying to cut back on my gluten. I don't know. But he told me to get these vitamins because it has extra iron in them. Um, and so we're gonna see how I, if I feel better. That's a long way of saying if I go MIA today, it's because I'm back in bed. Just trying to not get dizzy. So, should we go to Costco? Are you all done? No, not done yet. Can I have my notebook back? Yeah. And your phone. Thank you. Um, we're back to adding. He kind of forgot to add stuff to our Hawaiian accounts um, to start earning miles again on our Hawaiian Airlines accounts. And I was like, nah, -uh. no, I think it was in May. So after we got back from Hawaii in April, I went and pulled the first May statement. And I was like, why haven't you put anything on these credit cards? It's for work it would be work bills or whatever um that's our advantage um and he's like oh i hadn't thought about it and i'm like no you gotta rack up those miles so he did a good a good job this month putting some money on those accounts so i'm gonna set those to auto payments so we're gonna go deposit money for chelsea we're gonna make payments to ourself we're gonna go to costco so just wanted to kind of give you a little insider um Info, I ordered some things on the TikTok shop. I got these little, um, what do you call them? Medicine buckets. Um, I know it's a little preemptive for back to school, but when Chelsea was undoing her backpack after school got out, she was like, you know what would be really helpful next year is to have some pill packs like we had for travel. And I was like, oh, that's a really good idea. Plus, next year for middle school, Chelsea or Ashley can have... I'm looking for my little stickers. Where did they go? Um, Chelsea can have some of these pill packs for school, and I'm going to give them to Ashley as well. So acetaminophen, Tylenol, um, allergy meds, maybe a daytime cold pill in case they get a cold during the day. So I got those for them, and now I can't find the stickers. I thought for sure they were in this little thing. The little um, label stickers. Um, so, anyway, I also got Jason his um, Father's Day gift. Your shorts are in the dryer. Oh, nice. Yeah, that'll be I fun. got him a five pack of workout shorts for Father's Day, and they came. So, I think we're all caught up. And I actually got my sunglasses, my pair I wear. They say, oh, see there, I'm dizzy. Dizzy right now. Okay. See, this is this is where I become it becomes a problem. So I have my replacement pair eyewear. Can you even see this? 
on camera very much how the color has been come there you can see it right there those black spots are supposed to be pink so my pair of eyewear should be in the mailbox so I'm gonna go and check that on our way out otherwise I think we're caught up with you guys first step is my new sunglasses they look so pretty the white is even whiter um, and Jason just put if you if you maybe notice that he just put the uh, Dyson vacuum back in my car I'm so sad that was the secret thing we bought last week or the week before at Costco we bought it for me to have and then Kaylee was gonna get her old vacuum to take to school but Jacob's mom gave her a Roomba <laughs> she did the same thing she gave them a Roomba their old one and got a new one themselves so they had the same idea but they got to them first so now I don't get a new vacuum Taking it back. It's practical. Kids these days don't even have to vacuum their own place. I know. A little robot runs around and does it. I know. I'm the robot at home. And then she gets to take a robot to school. I vacuumed. I'm not saying you don't. Can you stop being it? <laughs> stop taking everything so personal. Ditto. I'm not. <laughs> so we forgot to film in Costco. <laughs> Um, but we had three different orders. We had to like think through. We're getting stuff for the business, like toilet paper, paper plates, um, our own personal stuff. And there was like different things that we don't normally get, which I'll show you. And then we have a church party after church on Sunday, just a little light luncheon after church. We realized that we don't have any plates. And then I just need to get some water bottles. So we're just kind of keeping track of them all and then doing three separate orders and I think about four different Costco people came up to us wanting to scan our water bottles and scan our toilet paper and we're like no 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 don't scan anything we need to keep it on three different orders so very helpful people we'll do a quick um as we toss them into the car we'll do a quick haul okay we got toilet paper um dove soap I'm gonna let him do it just because my dizziness um got two things of paper plates one for him and one for us or one for my party um, water bottles we want to get out and do these are on rebate still kids love these so we will get two of those this was Chelsea's one request can we have that mac and cheese for dinner tonight so she doesn't request very much so we're gonna get that we also got cucumbers bagels chips Celsius was on rebate, even though we don't need it right now. It's on rebate. And it was like a $6 rebate. So got that. Uh, graham crackers are on rebate as well. Bananas, that's normal. Two things of milk, because we are literally plum out. The second thing of plates, bread. It was a total fine. This was a fine. We went to get jelly, and Jason only likes jelly. So he doesn't oh, like great. the strawberry. Well, he doesn't like strawberry or raspberry jam. But look at this very blueberry fruit spread. So not only does it not have seeds in it, but this is gonna be excellent on pancakes or waffles. Oh, so good. So we got two of them. We also got blueberries, eggs, and this is an extra one. We got a daily multivitamin. I'll talk about that in a minute. Then we have lettuce and two strawberries. Is that it? Yeah, don't forget your list. I, I know, I think I wanna like protect this jelly a little bit better. Yeah, we don't want to roll I'm going to put it down here, but just remember it's down here, okay? okay. So a little bigger than normal, but that's because we had three different orders to take care of. So I think I mentioned it before. Uh, my dad wanted me to get a, multi, a multivitamin for women 50 plus because he said that that was one of the ones that has it like the most amount of iron in it. Um, and I was going to get the, what is it? What is, well, I can't remember the brand of it. What was the other brand? Like the actual brand? Centrum. Of, what is it? Centrum. Centrum um, multivitamin for 50 plus. Um, it had half the pills in it and the iron count in that one was like five milligrams. And then 
the generic multivitamin and it ne wasn't necessarily for 50 plus or for women. No, no, the, the Costco. Oh, it, what did it, what is it called again? It was uh, like multi-age, multi. Multi-mature. Multi-mature. So <laughs> it was for oh, like God. obviously 50 plus, um, but it had 18 milligrams, a hundred percent of your daily iron count. No, no. The one we got had yeah, hundred percent. I know that's what the I The one said. for multi-mature had zero iron. Oh, that's right. Zero iron for the multi mature. Yeah, which that's obviously right. Which obviously is not good for women. The regular one's better for women. Yeah. Than so the multi mature. So be careful if you're looking at the Costco multi mature. Yes. It did not have enough. I actually didn't have any. It didn't have any iron. I looked at it like twice. So we had to get a few extra things because we're getting older. It's fantastic. Just add that to my little pill. My little pill dispenser every day. And what were you making fun of me back in the day? I don't have a pill dispenser. Whatever. Now I do. Well, when you become like my grandma with her little carrying case, little yeah. pop up, it's like a fishing container that made to look nice for women that had like every pill under the sun. I'm not there yet. All right, we did not have luck on our side at the bank. I think it took five attempts to restart the computer. Um, well, actually, four logins and then two restarts. And then finally we were able to do one simple, two simple tasks. Um, not renew Kaylee's CD. Just transfer the money to her checking account. It's all in there. We have all legality to do so without her. And change the name on one of my savings accounts to Chelsea's name instead of Abby's name. And we were there for 50 minutes. <laughs> this is insane, you guys, insane. And then by the time I was done, I was like, I have to go to the bathroom so bad. I haven't, hadn't gone since we left the home like three hours ago. Four, yeah, like almost four hours ago. So we made a quick dash to McDonald's because I know the quick access to that one. I come out and Jason's like, we gotta hurry home. I have to go to the bathroom, which is where he's at because he refuses to go in public. Who remembers his, his little public experience in Hawaii? <laughs> anyway. I'm feeling better. I'm gonna go and let my Big Mac settle. I haven't had a Big Mac in, I don't even know how many years. I'm gonna go let that settle. We ate right before we went to the bank. Um, and I'm just gonna make sure that's settled before going for a walk, but I think I will. The sun is out, it's nice. It's only three o'clock now. I don't think Ashley has plans or she would have been bugging me to take her somewhere. Maybe her sisters actually took her somewhere, I don't know but I, they've all been home, so I know that they're all fine and they're taken care of, but I just don't know what everyone's doing. No one works today, so go and make sure that they're all okay. I just can't see myself, unless I'm truly still dizzy, which I'm fine just sitting here, but if I'm still dizzy, I'm not gonna go for a walk because I don't wanna go alone and then get dizzy while I'm there. But it's just, I have two podcasts I could listen to I just finished Rose Code this morning. I read it all weekend. Um, being in bed yesterday, I had many hours to listen to that and <laughs> not look at a screen. So I need to find a new book um, in case I am done with the podcast by the time I am done walking. But I'm going to go in and see. Yeah, see, Abby is asking me something. Oh, Abby's going to work. Okay. All right. So it's been a couple hours. I went upstairs thinking... I feel good enough to go for a walk. I'm gonna see how I feel walking up the stairs. Walked up the stairs, <laughs> have two or three little bouts of being dizzy. <sighs> so I laid down, I, didn't, I don't fall asleep, I'm not tired. I mean, I'm kind of tired, I'm lethargic, I guess I, you should say, you could say. Yeah, lethargic. <sighs> and I just, like zero energy. So he was watching TV. I just laid down, forgot to call my sister back. And it's now seven, almost seven o'clock. And um, I didn't realize how late it was. So we're putting this pizza in. It's not pizza. Um, <laughs> mac and cheese. How many times have we gone to Costco today and not admitted it? Well, this will be my third. Right, so the second time, we forgot, he went, while I was laying down, um, he went and got stamps, because we forgot stamps, and he just went to make Ashley a peanut butter sandwich. 
Our kids love peanut butter. <laughs> and we, we stock up on it, to be fair. And we just always think there's another one out in the garage. And there's not. Well, there's, I was actually making those for me. For my thing oh, tomorrow. for tomorrow? You, want to, you should tell them what you're doing tomorrow. I don't know how much of it you're going to be able to film if you're belaying. We'll show you what Ashley's doing really quick. She was able to find a friend to play with, so I was that's why I was able to lay down. What color are your hands, Ashley? Green? Where's your slime? Right there. Another batch of slime? You're okay? Mm -hmm. I should have showed your braids. They were so cute. She did two perfect French Dutch Dutch braids yesterday. They were so cute. Swifty for lives? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Perfect. So anyway, she's been occupied. We just put the mac and cheese in. And um, I'm just, I, it's fine that I didn't go for a walk today because I just feel super tired. Oh, I didn't finish that. But no, I do feel like I need to kind of get out of the house and just walk for a minute and like just be up. Because it was really hard to fall asleep last night when they didn't do anything all afternoon. So I need to just be vertical. I'm gonna drive. Yeah, you can drive. Can you just not be crazy? What? Can you just, here, take this. I also forgot to take my water up when I was upstairs, so I need to drink all of that and then another one with my dinner. It would have been the perfect to good day to go walking because it's like sunny. Where's the blue? Sunny, but not hot at all. It was like not even 70. And I, that's why I went upstairs to try and go. So I was like, this is perfect weather. But I just don't wanna like, he could have come with me to go walking, but I didn't, he didn't really feel like it either. He's feeling like, eh, as well. And I didn't really feel like going alone. And Anyway, I'm not so dizzy that I would fall over. Can you turn that off, please? Put that in. Yeah, now we have four receipts from Costco to scan. <laughs> um, but you should tell them what you're doing tomorrow. All right, tell them what you're gonna go do. Yeah, I will. Do you wanna tell them what you're gonna go do tomorrow? It's up in, uh, what do they call those? San Juans. And you're going to the San Juans? It's like all the way up there. Holy moly. I didn't know you were going clear up there. It's like an hour and 40 minutes north. Holy cow. Uh, I think they're doing some camp for uh, young boys or whatever. The youth. The youth, yeah, or boys. Um, and they have this uh, the state park there. There's this big rock face where they're going to do some uh, climbing and rappelling. And so myself and another guy are going up to meet other people because we know how to belay people and help them with the ropes and stuff. So it should be fun. But what time do you have to wake up in the morning? Um, <laughs> I'm setting the alarm for 510. Because you're meeting him at like 530? I'm meeting him at like 610. Because you have to be there by like 830. Yeah, eight kind of thing. But I got to swing by the store and drop off like a little piece of paper with something that needs to be ordered I forgot to do. I'm sorry you have to wake up so early. You'll have fun. It'll be fun. It'll be beautiful. Um, yeah, it'll be fun. Don't wake me up. <laughs> um, yeah, I didn't know it was clear up in the San Juans. I knew it was up north, but I didn't know it was that far up. So, all right, well, third trip to Costco. I actually wanted to go to like Trader Joe's and get the flowers and decorate a little bit more today and do film that video, film and like take photos of my 4th Spring of July. <laughs> this man is the most holiday unaware man I've ever met. What holiday did I just decorate for, honey? I guess the 4th of July. Yeah, it's not spring. We're in June. Well, it's Washington. Spring comes later. Jason. He's like the most, like I'll just pull out the, like the Christmas decoration and he's like, oh. What are we decorating for? <laughs> what pins do you need? You know you're like that. 
He's very unaware of holidays. <laughs> very unaware. Okay, we are officially with peanut butter and stamps because he forgot those on the second time. All right, I'm gonna end my day with you guys. <laughs> Normally, you can see how red this eye is. You guys, it's so bad. I mean, I look really red on camera. It's just because I keep like rubbing my face. I'm not sunburned, but this eye is super irritated. I've washed it. <sighs> I think my allergies are part of my like low energy. It's just my eyes, they itch, and they're super dry now because I keep rubbing them. But we just were so sick of going to the store today <laughs> that I didn't want to go to Target to go get some eye drops. And I felt bad. I didn't want to send Jason out to the store again. But I'm hoping to go and get some tomorrow. My friend wants me, wants to go walking with me in the morning and when I told her about how I've been feeling dizzy and stuff and she's like, oh my gosh, let me go with you. Definitely let me go with you because I don't want you walking alone if you're still feeling like that. So she is, she's gonna go with me and um, keep an eye on me. So um, anyway, I feel bad that all we did today was go to Costco and the bank, but Chelsea officially has a checking account or a savings account. Kaylee has money for college, which is wonderful. And we have food in the fridge, enough food, <laughs> plenty of food. Someday, I don't know, I think we're just, I feel like we're waiting for summer to start. I feel like I'm still in like prep mode for summer to start. Um, I part of it, cause I haven't gone to the beach. I haven't like hung out with friends. I haven't like done summer activities. You know what I mean? Like I'm hoping my fr friends are like available next week. I should actually text and see if people want to start and do a beach day next week. If not like all of my friends, see if Ashley and all of her friends want to go one of these days. Um, just so I have an excuse to go sit in the sun. <laughs> I'll get my steps in, I'll get my walk in before I take him to the beach and then I can just go and relax at the beach. It, the water will not be warm enough to get in. In fact, I rarely get in the lake anymore unless I'm on someone's boat. So I just, I don't feel like we've done like summer activities and part of that is because we've had like really weird weather. We've had really hot days, but I wasn't ready to like go to the pool, which we only have one pool available. It's grandpa's pool and it's, anyway. Not, th not not the perfect scenario, but I'm actually really wanting to have a pool day. So as soon as we have some really, really good weather, I might ask him. So it doesn't quite feel like it's summer yet. So that's why I'm kind of tinkering and working on projects. I do need to like ramp up and start doing the girls' bedrooms on days where it's not quite warm enough um, because we really got to like gut them and get them prepped to like switch all around. Um, so anyway, it may not feel like I'm bringing you guys summer videos, but this is just kind of what we're doing. We're kind of still in like this pre-summer mode and just trying to get used to the schedule and not having to like do things. So um, I hope you're enjoying. I'm sorry, my energy is really low right now. I don't want to bring the video down. So I'm going to end it with you. Stick around. We'll see what we get up to. Um, we do have fun things to do. It's just like next month. <laughs> next month is going to be really fun uh, as we kind of get into the holiday, get into the summer season. So stick around. Um, thanks for hanging out with us and we'll take, and we will see you guys next time. Good night.